Okay guys, it's uh, 12.18 and uh, I'm going to go out and try to find a place to go hunt for about an hour or so, so let's see what we can find. Still pretty light out. Of course my windows are tinted so it makes it look darker than what it is on the sides. Sounds like a jet taking off at the airport. Nice, uh, I was gonna say sunset, but it's like 20 to one. Well, I'm back to check out one of my favorite spots. This nice little park and these volleyball courts. You can tell somebody's been using them. So uh, let's see what we can find. Plus there's some adjoining baseball fields there. I'd like to search the grass all around this and make sure I've thoroughly searched that too. Found a ring over there last time, so all right, let's get started. <clears throat> okay, and of course, the first target of the day, wadded up aluminum foil. Got lots of that. All right, I'll check the rest of this area out. Well, I'm over on the edge of the uh, volleyball court, and I had a pretty good signal, so I thought I should dig it. And I uh, just got it out, and uh, I'm pretty sure what it is. I worked long and hard to find that. But it's an old one, so that's a good sign. So I'll keep looking. There's a little rabbit over there. I don't know if you can see it or not. Anyways, I just had uh, another target here I thought was promising. I was getting like a silver reading on it. I don't know, it says uh, something in England, made in England. That's weird. Looks like one of those little things you put strings through. And Anyways, I'll keep looking. Okay, so I had another good signal right on the edge. And I've got it in that, so let me get it out and see. Well, I was hoping for silver. Ended up being a quarter. I can't see the date. If I'm lucky, it's... Oh, okay, I see it's, it. looks like a bicentennial. Cool. All right, I'll keep looking. <clears throat> I just found a coin. Looks like a dime. I just dug another monster hole and uh, found me a dime. Found a new, a new nickel. Well, just had another target and had to dig for it and uh, found me an old nickel. Can't see the date, so I have to check it out when I get home. It was three or four inches down. So I'm checking out this little lawn right beside the volleyball courts, and uh, found my like third dot of uh, nickel. Hopefully I'll find something a little better. All right, just had another target. Man, I don't know if you guys can see these mosquitoes, but jeez. All right, so I just had another target and dug me up a dime. So I'm kind of hoping it might be a silver one, maybe. But I can't see the date. Alright, so I'll keep a looking. It's like 2, 2.30 in the morning. <sighs> okay, I'm out on the edge of these baseball fields and just found me a giant chunk of metal. Okay, just had another target as I was working to the car. And it's a big plate. I knew it was too big. I knew it had to be trash. Anyway. Okay, this is everything that I dug up over at the uh, volleyball courts uh, over at Groudon Park. This big steel plate, a bunch of chunks of metal, foil, uh, some nice old bottle caps and stuff, beaver tails. I uh, found a quarter, 
found a, uh, five dimes. The oldest is a 66. I found three quarters. The oldest is a 63. And I found five pennies. The oldest is a, uh, what did I say, 60, 64. So, anyways, and then I found this little thing that says Made in England. And this little surface fine of that little tassel. And that was about it. Very short hunt. Alright guys, till next time, good luck. Happy hunting.